Anyway guys, I don't know if you can hear that, but the surf has laid, it's like glass. Well, three foot chalk glass. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if we'll be able to get out or not. We'll give it a shot. I found a place, if I can time it, the third bar has got some big breakers coming over once in a while. It's got some, I don't know, three or four footers. But if I can time it right, I can get right through that. Once I'm past that, uh, 250 yards out, should be a pretty easy go from there. So uh, I can see the kingfish from here. I just got to go get them. They're not going to catch themselves, right? So uh, I guess nobody's posted me a, uh, a trip with details this week. I guess it's going to have to be me showing you guys how good or how bad it is. So uh, let's get to it. We'll head out there. Get back to you in a little bit. All right, guys. We made it out. That was rough. But I think you can see Bob Hall Pier there behind me. I'm half a mile or better from shore. And uh, I have 18 inches of viz. The water's dirty on out from the surf pretty good. So hopefully it'll clear up when we get a little further out. Uh, maybe we'll just keep paddling until we get some cleaner, cleaner water. We managed a little uh, jack. It's one of the little lesser amber jacks or Mine's tangled a bit, but we got fish on. <laughs> I got a dozen ribbon fish this morning. They're over two feet long. This is it's like the ones you catch at the jetties on your own. And I figured, you know, the water's so clear. I haven't been getting them on my sparkle skirts. So I just threw them out naked, just a wire rig cast and blast style. I barely put it in the rod holder and it was going off. So that's why you carry bear rigs too. Got fish on. Looks like a good king. <laughs> oh, he woke up. He's like, hey man, I got a toothache. This treble hook sticking in my mouth. Thanks a lot, Professor. I thought you were my friend. Sticking a hook in my. Yeah, baby. Hooks out of you. Professor Salt, BDS. There's a croaker bait, sand flea. Stuck on your butt. I wonder you're cranky. That would be too. Alright, all hooks out. How's that? It's not bad fish. It's not bad at all. No bonus points, but I'm cool with that. I don't need bonus points on every fish. Once in a while, it's nice. Well, we're on to something. He ate a 20-inch bluefish. I just put it on for bait. 
Uh, it's acting like a big shark, so I'm going to turn the video off. When it get him closer, I'll uh, turn it back on. There he is, fellas. Nice little shark of some sort. Well, hello. Look at what I got. Nice. About five feet of tired shark right there. We got another kingfish. Get the boat turned around. He made some, a really strong run. I hope he's a good one. We've already got two in the bag that are not bad, so a big 50 inch or better would be nice. I don't know. It's a pretty good one. One more down. I think I'm going to go give it to this guy at the, at the rig. Uh, I had two sharks following him right up to the boat trying to steal him, so I went ahead and gaffed him. I'll give him to this guy. Well, it looks easy from up here. You get down there in the middle of it. That's some intimidating surf. I got through, no turtles. Kayak was totally full of water, but that's okay. Pretty good day. I think I'll, uh, We'll come back and do it again tomorrow.